Hey YouTube, Mark Kaufman here. And today I want to show you a different method on how to repair serrations on a heavily used knife. Now, I've already done a video on how to sharpen a serrated knife. Now, this is the way that I go about uh, resharpening or re, I, I guess, reteething a really damaged serrated knife. Now, how I did this is I, now you can see you have teeth on this now, like they're like, there are legitimate teeth on here. Now I have not stropped these up just yet, but um, you can see that these smaller teeth are now more pronounced and I'm telling you they cut, they really do cut. And you can see that there's more of a uh, pronounced tooth on that serrated edge now. The way I did this is I used a, you can get these on eBay anywhere. Um, you can even get them at Smoky Mountain Knife Works, but you can get these portable little mini sharpeners. And I actually used the diamond rod from that. And I put that in a, you, well, you can use a Dremel. I used a electric screwdriver and held it in a vise. And what you do, which I will show you in this clip, Now you can see that is pretty effective. If you're not careful, you will remove quite a bit of material. Now, this is the deal about that. Um, doing this process, you have to have a very steady hand, check often on how much material you're actually removing. Um, one of the things that helped me is that I used an older diamond rod, so it didn't cut as quick, but it still cut and because of its cone shape, when you advance up the tooth, you're actually pushing that serration more outward like this, which is going to make those teeth sharper. Um, you don't wanna to go too far, however, because if you do, you're gonna make those teeth go upward uh, because you're obviously taking material out of the center of that serration. So you've got to be very careful. You have to keep a good eye on it, but trust me, the, the process works. And then you can follow all the other steps that I did to get these polished up. Now this is very, very sharp. And I think it, it looks quite good. I mean, it really brought back those teeth and it, it it really allowed this to get that bite that it needs instead of having all those teeth that were already chopped up. So I hope this video really helps anybody out there trying to sharpen a serrated knife. And if you're out there looking for uh, deals, don't be afraid to buy a partially serrated knife. Trust me, um, you can get partially serrated knives for almost 50 to 75% off the retail used because people don't wanna mess with the serrations. But now that you know how to sharpen a serrated knife, I hope that you can find some really good deals out there. So if this video helped you out, let me know in the comments and give this video a thumbs up if it really did help. And again, thank you guys so much for checking out my channel. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and click that notification bell to let you know when I upload new videos. So hope this video helped you guys out. And um, if it did, there you go. I'm just glad I could help you. So till the next video, I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.